In this example, we will create index with a custom name. Of course, this custom name doesn't affect in any way index operation. But you can create it in order to better understand the purpose of the index. So result will be number of indexes after 4, before it was 3 in this example, and get indexes will show you that new index was created and name is custom h index in this example. Ok, let's go to the shell and try this. Before creating a new index, let's try one more thing. Let's try to create the same index that was created before. So just this one by name. Let's execute this operation, command enter. As a result of operation, we will see note, all indexes already exist. And num indexes before will be equal to num of indexes after. This means that if a certain index already exists, it will not be recreated. Ok, let's go on and create index by age. So age1 and let's give it custom name. Name is a string custom age index. And let's execute this. Command enter. So index was created. Now I have four indexes. Let's go back to get indexes tab and execute this operation. So now there are four indexes and last one is a newly created index. And you see its name custom age index. Ok, let's go on and next we will try to perform some queries using newly created indexes. But before we will talk about query performance. See you shortly.